Hapagloy just finished its fiscal year 2017 and joining me now is the CEO of Hapagloy, Ralph Haben Jansen. What's your view on the 2017 performance? I think all in all we can be happy with 2017. For us it was a special year because we had the uh, merger and integration with UAC. But in the end I believe we delivered a, a quite satisfactory result and we're also able to complete the integration within the year, which was the original plan. What are the key achievements? I think when you look at the achievements for 2017, first of all, a significantly improved uh, financial result. Second of all, also thanks to the hard work of, of all our colleagues, a successful integration of the teams who are really working together already quite uh, seamlessly. And thirdly, we also managed to, uh, to grow our volume roughly in line with the market, which in a year of integration, I think is definitely a success and a big thanks to everybody around the globe. Why did Hapagloy propose to pay an extraordinary dividend? Well, in the end, if you look at what happened over the last three or four years, then our shareholders uh, invested 1.2 billion into the company when we really needed it on the back of the, of the two mergers and also when we went public. Uh, and we believe that it's very important to now send a signal to them that we are really thankful for their commitment to the company. And that's why we proposed the extraordinary div dividend. What's on the agenda for 2018? Well, for 2018, it's all about making sure that we capture all the synergies out of the merger with UASC. Of course, we should continue to, to grow in line with the market and, and hopefully we're also going to be able to uh, you know, further invest in uh, our strategy towards 2023. And in the end, we also need to deliver an even better result in 18 than we did in 2017. Do you see any potential challenges? I mean, nothing extraordinary apart from the usual things that you see, which are all about or how do, do supply and demand continue to develop and what's going to happen with uh, bunker prices. But those are the normal things. So I don't see anything extraordinary at this point in time. But then again, you know, it remains shipping. So that means that we may be in for one or the other um, surprise in the course of the year. And if that happens, we just need to react and uh, need to make sure that we stay on track. Ralph Haben Jansen, the CEO of Hapagloid. Thank you very much for the interview and thank you for watching.